Okay, today is going to be a short video. It's actually we're just getting ready to put our elastic band into our leggings. So right here, I'm just taking them, uh, the leggings inside out. Remember, you always want to do all your work on the inside of the fabric. So I'm taking it here and I am just folding it down. That's all you're going to do on both sides. That was the elastic that normally goes in leggings. However, I think I'm going to just go ahead and use a different size um, when I put the elastic in. And the size is up to you. You can do half inch, inch, whatever you want to do, but you'll just need to make it adjustable to the, uh, the inches that you decide to go with with the elastic. So right here, I'm just pinning it down. So I'm just showing you I'm folding it. And that's basically all you're going to do is put the elastic in once you get done pinning it. But before you can get to the elastic part, you need to make sure that you leave an opening. So I'm going to sew around the entire um, waist of the leggings. However, uh, I'm going to leave a spot open. Normally, I leave it open around the hip area. So then it is uh, not very noticeable at all because you're going to sew it back close. It's just so you can get your elastic in once you do a zigzag stitch right there where I'm showing you. A zigzag stitch holds it a lot better because you have to think about it. Um, that is where that is going to be stretching the most. So right here, I'm just getting ready to go ahead and sew um, my uh, fabric down with a zigzag stitch. Uh, make sure you have all your supplies ready. My bobbin was empty. Until next time, signing off.